Hello and welcome to my video lecture on the use of uh, PHP constants. Um, constants are uh, a, a, an interesting kind of variable in that uh, the use of them means that their value can never be altered during the running of the code. Uh, any of these variables that we have so far in our, PH, in our index PHP file can be manipulated. Um, I can uh, I can change uh, first name and I can make it equal to last name and I can concatenate I can change things and make first name uh, concatenated with something else and then the, the first name variable completely changes um, and I can do that fairly uh, easily by doing uh, string first name um, is equal to the uh, concatenated with um, can type <laughs> um, and I can concatenate it with a, a space a p a dot right so the first name actually changes its value the value stored in the first name uh, variable changes uh, what we want to do is we want something that's not going to change so we're going to use uh, a define function um, the define function is what we're going to use uh, to set the value. Uh, so in this case we can define something like pi uh, and we can set it equal to you know 3.14 and not go any crazier than that. So here pi can never be changed. I cannot change pi anywhere in this code but I can use pi uh, the same way I use any other variable and I can use that in uh, code. Uh, I want to make sure I end my define with my semicolon. And then if I save that and I go to my browser and I see that this is my old code, now I get, um, well, the concatenation didn't quite work, did it? What am I doing there? Um, That's interesting. That should have worked fine. First name, and I'm changing it. Oh, this is, this has to be PHP. <laughs> All right, so uh, this has to be PHP uh, because I'm actually messing around with a variable. And then I have to uh, end my PHP. So here, I'm actually changing my PHP code. Whoops. Um, so I'm gonna save that. I go to my browser, and then when I refresh that, I get uh, Mike.p.devlin. Uh, so first name now is actually Mike P instead of just Mike. And then here's my calculation. Uh, I really should throw a break in here. Um, just again to make it a little bit more visually appealing. And then I'll save that, and I'll refresh that, and there we go. So Mike, Mike P. Devlin is a great guy, and that obviously is not my birthday. And this is the calculation after uh, we, can, we calculate 21 times 0.05 times pi. And um, that concludes um, my video lecture on the use of uh, PHP constants uh, in your code. Uh, I hope you find reasons and ways to use constants in uh, your PHP code.